Hello, hello, my beautiful people. Thanks so much for stopping by my channel. If you're new here, welcome. My name is Garetti, and today I am going to be doing a winter solstice reading for you guys. So happy winter solstice. Also, happy birthday to all of you Capricorns as we're going into Capricorn season now. Um, I am a Capricorn sun and moon, so happy birthday to me as well. I just wanted to do an extra video for you guys. I know I have done a lot of them, but I just wanted to do an extra one for you guys uh, for this winter solstice because it is a very important time as we're approaching you know the holidays christmas time a new year so this is really a time for us to kind of go within to reflect on you know the past year um you know what have we accomplished what you know what's gone on how have we changed what do we want you know for our futures what do we want for the new year 14 14 on the clock there so somebody needs to uh look that up but this number is very important as well it is 12 21 right so those are mirrored numbers that's another number you you might want to look into but with 1221 being a mirrored number this is also a time for like i said it's that reflection that introspection taking a look at our life what have we created what do we want to change what do we like and we want more of right this is also a time to really step into the power of gratitude so you guys i really encourage that many of you guys kind of take you know stock of like what has happened in 2023 uh, figure out what you want for 2024 what do you want to change a 333 on the clock there for some of you need to look that up um and it was also 1331 so another mirrored number is saying that you know what is the reflection of your life is that what you want? And if you don't, this is a time for you to, if you don't know about manifesting, this would be a time for you to learn more about manifesting. Um, and also a time for you guys to really, um, you know, reflect on the past year set your goals this isn't like you know new year's resolutions this is really about what do you want to create for 2024 what do you want to manifest for your life okay um what do you kind of want to work on throughout the winter before spring comes where things start to blossom right what do you want to put the work into okay so i'm going to be using my uh hello winter which is literally hello winter winter solstice and again happy birthday to my beautiful capricorns if you are celebrating here in December. I will do another birthday reading for Capricorns uh, into January. All right, so we're going to cleanse our energy space, remove all negative energies and entities and any evil eye from your space and mine. Thank you. It is done. It is done. And so it is. All right, my loves. So as I was cleansing our space, spirit came through with a message saying that many of you, this is also a time to get rid of what you don't want and not just thoughts, patterns, behaviors, um, belief systems but also things this is about you know winter is kind of like things going dormant or dying off right so this is going through all your physical things like old clothes that you have that you don't wear you haven't worn for years get rid of them because that's lack mentality when we hold on to those things get rid of those things so that we can have new things fresh things so we can bring freshness and new vibrant energy into our life this is how we create a life of abundance right so you want to do things from an abundant state of mind it's you know when we get those christmas gifts right as well it is you know if you get new clothes get rid of the old you know if you get whatever it is that you get new get rid of the old this is a time to let things die off that are not good for you so that we can you know bring in new okay so as well for many of you guys if you don't know about manifestation this is a time for you to you know learn about it i mean i know it's a simple concept but it's not something easy for us to do basically really it's what do you think about what do you believe right what are your assumptions um what's your vibration right all right my loves so spirit we're gonna do a collective message so this is for the collective on my channel anybody watching this is for the collective messages and guidance please holy spirit what do they need to know for the winter solstice and capricorn season winter solstice and capricorn season for the collective and one more spirit thank you all right you guys bottom of the deck sweet surprise good things are happening we have you know um 
the stocking here and a lot of you know sweet treats and goodness uh, going into the stocking what I see here for you guys is many of you guys getting you know gifts getting surprises but I'm also seeing that during this time during the winter solstice and uh, Capricorn time many of you guys are going to have some sweet surprises there's going to be good things uh, happening for you guys uh, as well especially for Capricorns Capricorns you guys have been through it Pluto is finally in 2024 coming out of our sign so you guys are finally going to get rest a break relief absolutely beautiful okay so let's cut the deck you guys can't even make this up okay as i said that um this card closed for now try again later so what this is saying a couple of messages came through one is that's it capricorns uh we are closed for the lessons we've learned the lessons we are locked right up um you know try again later in another what is it i i don't think it'll ever happen in our lifetime actually again so that's it we're closed you know for pluto lessons we're all done with that since 2008 we have been through it okay for the last 15 years but this is also saying um you you know to take a break capricorns you're the hardest working sign in the zodiac um and other signs as well you know not just capricorn virgo and taurus that i do a lot of readings a lot of the collective on my channel seems to be earth signs this is saying to take a break doesn't matter what sign you are this is just saying to take a break this is a time for us to really shut things down this is not a time for us to keep pushing forward and working this is a time this winter solstice is you know to kind of shut some things down like i said let things go that no longer serve you as well bottom of the deck we have lucky star it's time to take a chance so you guys time to take a chance on your dreams this is for you guys to really wish upon a star this is for you guys to really dream big so this is saying you know whatever it is um you know whatever your dreams are i just heard shine like a star so some of you really need to shine kind of your inner light with other people with the world um because you know right after that we also have cup of kindness the love will show the way so i feel like some of you guys are light workers some of you guys really have this beautiful light energy and loving heart that you do need to share with the world but also it says time to take a chance so you guys what are you dreaming about what do you want for 2024 what has this year taught you you know um what are your wishes right so this is the lucky star this is saying wishes are going to come true for you guys and then top of the deck says hanging in there it will get better soon so whatever you're going through if you haven't seen your manifestations happen if you are you know capricorn dealing with pluto guys it's going to get better soon. I promise you, especially when uh, Pluto moves out of Capricorn sign on January the 20th. So Capricorn, hang in there just a few more weeks, okay? Or if you have Capricorn prominent in your chart and you've been dealing with Pluto for the last 15 years, hang in there, okay? Um, and guys, this is also talking about follow your heart. What are your dreams what do you want to follow here follow your heart all right my loves so let's get into the tarot and see what uh spirit has to say through there three 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 on the clock you guys that is an angel message spirit letting us know that we are being protected and divinely guided we're not alone all right so messages and guidance please for my beautiful capricorns uh for their birthdays in december as well as the winter solstice for the collective messages and guidance please for the winter solstice for the collective messages and guidance all right my loves final shuffle i will lay the cards out and i will walk you through it okay many of you juggling a lot of things two of pentacles and then we have two of wands at the bottom of the deck okay so many of you are kind of going back and forth back and forth wishy-washy thoughts because my two of wands is the prayer card this is you guys planning from your for your future okay so many of you guys are also going kind of juggling going back and forth in your thoughts like what do i want for my future which direction should i go so that's okay but also when it comes to manifesting you don't want wishy-washy thinking you want to grab hold of the direction that you want to go in and that is the prayer that you want to make and prayer isn't about like please can i have this prayer is basically um you guys putting out there into the universe kind of like ordering something online it is saying here's what i want and i believe that i will receive it okay 
and being thankful and say you know uh and believing that you are going to receive it and have faith and continue to have those good and positive thoughts all right my loves so let's keep moving let's see yeah guys you cannot even make this up what was i talking about you know shut things down walk away from things that no longer serve you you guys this is so beautiful this is so beautiful okay i will actually sorry bottom of the deck as well yeah, you guys, if you're worried about anything, don't worry. This is definitely a time for you to really take action, okay? All right, so center of your spread. What did I say? Eight of cups. This is walking away from what no longer serves you. What happened in 2023? What, um, you know, is it your health? Is it finances? Is it somebody that you, um, you know, from your past that you need to let go of? Is it old beliefs, habits? You know, um, I did say that at the beginning of the reading. That's the energy I was picking up. Old clothes, items, things that you don't need. Let those things go. In the current energy, we have Eight of Pentacles. Okay, especially because I'm reading for Capricorns uh, as well um, as the most prominent energy, Earth signs. Um, you guys are really hardworking. This is some of you, maybe during the winter solstice, you know, right before Christmas, maybe things are shutting down um, because a lot of things do, you know, kind of lock up for Christmas, right? At least for a few days. This is, you know, you guys may be working really hard uh, kind of towards the end here um on your dreams working really hard uh, so that you guys can take a break is what i'm hearing um what you do actually i'll do the recent past so in the recent past we have the world so this is about completion this is something wrapping up this is something you know kind of coming to a close so that there can be new beginnings not surprised next to that eight of cups walking away from what no longer serves you so whatever in your past no longer serves you this is time to wrap it up this is also wrapping up you know 2023 so that 2024 can happen many of you guys might be traveling or just uh traveling um you know as well here with the world card what you guys don't see coming you can't even make this up i just got goosebumps this is ten of cups this is bliss this is happily ever after this is the everything card if you are a Capricorn or anybody on this channel, really, um, you know, if you're watching this video, this is for the collective. This is saying um, that you guys are going to get your happily ever after. I just heard dreams do come true. Okay. Um, this is bliss. This is happiness. This is health. This is wealth. This is the job, the family, the relationship, the love, the romance, um, you know, the career, the passion, the, um, you know, the fun, it's the, the home, the everything. This is the everything card. Your advice from spirit is the chariot keep going forward balance the light and dark within you this is saying to really kind of you know um the emperor is the one or santa in this deck is the one in charge here uh in the chariot this is saying uh, for many of you i'm also hearing some of you guys need to go traveling around the world okay um you know like santa does right but this is also saying uh for many of you guys that you really need to um you know kind of um take charge take the reins you know take charge of your life um kind of like the emperor right you know to to just uh grab those reins it keep going uh you know hone in that light and dark energy you know bring both together so that they can work together okay and keep moving forward this is also success and victory this is quick moving action so move quickly towards the things that you love that you're passionate about okay your potential outcome you guys ace of pentacles like oh my goodness like what an incredible reading happy winter solstice and happy birthday capricorn you guys this is an offer maybe coming in this is a gift coming in for the universe what was the first card that came out you guys sweet surprise good things are happening capricorn and the collective on here for the winter solstice look at you guys are getting gifts you guys are getting opportunities you guys this is a success this is you know something tangible so it could be money it could be health it could be a career it could be an actual physical asset like a home but this also can be love you guys because you know it can be you know something tangible like a relationship okay um this could be you know moving in together you know those kinds of things uh but you guys this is offers opportunities this is a successful um gift from the universe it is beautiful okay bottom of the spread can't even make this up king of pentacles this is the earth card this is capricorn virgo taurus right most of you guys on my channel tend to be earth signs 
or resonate with that have a prominent placement in your uh, sign. This is somebody who's very abundant. This is somebody who is, um, you know, very stable, secure in their life. So, and look at what he's holding, male or female, take it how it resonates, swap roles, right? We all embody both. But look at what he's holding. He is holding the gift from the universe. So underneath the deck, you don't see this. Whatever this gift is, is going to bring you a lot of abundance and stability, okay, in your life. And confirmation all right nine of swords so some of you guys maybe some sleepless nights some worries some fears some anxiety in regards to whatever this is it's going to be different for everybody whether it's you know relationships uh whether it's a uh, health finances career whatever this is this is saying stop worrying you guys have nothing to fear i just heard you are going to have stability and success here you're going to be abundant because look at what is coming in for you guys like i mean you can't even make this up just keep going forward Forward. keep working towards your goals all right uh, continue to put the work in i heard to yourself as well as to your manifestations because the next card that we have is the ace of wands this is a passionate new beginning but this is also you guys remember i said grab hold of that wand right w with the two of wands grab hold of the direction that you want to go in this passionate uh you know new beginning here for many of you whatever this is and seven of cups this is daydreaming you know this is many options you guys are going to have have lots of offers and different opportunities and options you guys can look at but you guys this is saying to really take that uh you know want move forward towards what you are passionate about what you love and also daydreaming about it that is you guys really being focused on what it is that you want dreaming about what it is that you want and you guys this is saying for you guys to really kind of put the thoughts this is a lot of day daydreaming and thoughts for me in this uh lots of great you know sweet surprises here lots of options this is saying for you guys uh to really be focused on your happiness be focused on the light part of yourself be focused on positive okay and then you guys what did i say you guys are bossing it up with the emperor here this is you guys taking charge of your life this is you guys grabbing hold of the reins of the chariot and moving forward okay towards victory and success towards all of these opportunities towards a bliss and happily ever after like guys what an incredible reading absolutely beautiful okay let me see i am being called to pull an archangel michael card for you guys messages and guidance for the collective archangel michael you know christmas time especially with lots of angels uh around you know okay that card wanted to come out okay messages and guidance for the collective watching okay another water card <laughs> wow you guys can't even make this up there's cards popping up and i don't have that happen often okay you guys wow <laughs> wow Oh my goodness, you guys can't even make this up. Okay. All right. And one more. Okay. Okay. Yeah. If you guys are worried about anything, Nine of Swords at the bottom here, this situation is already resolved. It's already taken care of. Whatever you're worrying about, it is already taken care of. If you don't see it in your 3D physical reality yet, it's already happening in the 5D in the, you know, spiritual realm. Okay. So lots of cards came out. The one that popped out was you are on the right path. So Archangel Michael is saying, you know, spirit is telling you here, you are on the right path. You're going in the right direction. That uh, chariot, you know, take action, go forward. You guys are going in the right direction. So you have nothing to fear. And of course, the next card that had popped out was go forward fearlessly this is literally you guys being the emperor and taking charge taking the reins of your life you know take the authority over your own life because you have that power as a conscious creator as a conscious manifester okay you guys are the creators of your reality okay go forward without fear let go of the fear and for many of you this is what you're letting go of actually is fears okay fear worry anxiety you know, anything, uh, obsessions, anything that keeps you in bondage, okay? And then we have positive thoughts, okay, came out. Um, we have pay attention to your dreams, okay? A favorable outcome. Believe and trust, you guys. Have confidence. Have confidence in yourself, okay? And then we have make a commitment. So some of you actually need to commit to a life purpose 
commit to going back to school, commit to a certain career, commit to, you know, investing in your health, make a commitment to another person. Maybe this is taking the relationship to the next level, whatever that is for you. It could be, you know, just uh, finally saying, okay, we're in a relationship, or it could be, you know, let's get married or let's move in together or whatever this is. Okay. Make a commitment, um, you know, to somebody, but for others of you, this is making a commitment to yourself, making a commitment to your job, whatever this is. And then you guys also got your home is protected by angels. You guys are protected at this time. So when I was called to pull, one of the Archangel Michael uh, cards, which many of them came out and I was called to pull all of those. But what I was getting is that we are all being protected right now. Um, you know, this is such a beautiful, magical time, whether you guys, you know, um, celebrate Christmas or not, you know, Christmas time happens, you know, in Capricorn season, it happens, you know, uh, during this winter solstice time, it is just a time of so much hope. And uh, I know some people have a really hard time during this time. But this is, you know, also a time where there is a lot of that angelic presence or, uh, you know, kind of focus on like angels, you know, as, as tree toppers, and we see a lot of, you know, angel stuff and, you know, uh, songs with angels and things like that, uh, which is so beautiful whether you believe in angels or not but if you're on my channel you probably do uh, have some spiritual beliefs but you guys um, we are definitely being guided and protected by our angels at this time bottom of the deck somebody else needs to hear this but this is your life's purpose okay so whatever it is that you are needing to make a commitment to as well as part of your life purpose all right my loves so happy solstice or winter solstice happy winter solstice Merry Christmas to those who celebrate. Happy holidays. Happy Hanukkah. Um, you know, Happy New Year. If, you know, I will be putting out some more videos, but if I don't say it, Happy New Year as well. And happy birthday to all you Capricorns that are celebrating in December along with me uh, as well. And you guys, as always, please do all the things. Like, share, comment down below. I love hearing from you guys and responding to you guys. Um, subscribe to my channel if you're new here and you haven't already done so. I would absolutely love to hear have you part of this ever growing a butterfly family um, as well hit the bell icon so you get notified of new videos and you guys when you do all of these things or any number of these things truly I mean I appreciate each and every one of you it is the best way to help me uh, grow my channel to get spirits messages out there and guys this is really the best way to support me and I mean it really doesn't cost you anything to click on a button uh, and help me out that way so I would really appreciate you guys as I am trying to uh, grow this channel all right my loves so as always i wish you all peace love and light until next time bye, -bye.